And so if you're a novice to painting or you don't have the skill to create realistic images, say landscape and all that, you don't have to learn those skills so much anymore because the guys at NVIDIA are actually doing research and trying to create more of a generative adversarial network, which would help you change your doodles into astonishing graphics and astonishing images. And this is a research that's still currently going on within the NVIDIA research center. These guys are trying to create a tool that would make every single doodle you make on a canvas be converted into a realistic image. Say you decide to paint the sky, a tree, hill, sand, road. It has a deep learning technology behind it, which simply makes this app super intelligent so far to actually dictate what you're doing and in cases of reflection, once you paint a water, automatically it reflects whatever thing that is above that water. This is amazing. And one of the things that the demo is, just in case you decide to put some snow somewhere, automatically the app would recognize what time of day, what season it is, and it will change the skyline for you. This is definitely going to be revolutionary once it is released to the public. From the first time I just got to see this app, what I can tell is it makes use of a much more painter-like effect. Because if you look up close to the app, you would definitely notice that it has some sort of post-impressionist painting idea towards it. And this is also something that hopefully you would maybe love depending on what kind of art you prefer. From the NVIDIA blog, it is reported that this app has been trained with about a million images, which simply defines how well this app understands all of those things that it could be able to compute. And in as much as it can create amazing landscape and all that, they're still thinking of how they can leap into creating buildings, people, street signs, and all of those other amazing things. And one of the things that I would actually like to talk about while we're looking at this app is that once you get a look at the app, you understand that it's quite a very simple interface. I don't know if the images by this side are actually referenced images so that the computer or the app would be able to recognize what and what, or maybe you can feed in more things to it. I'm actually suggesting that maybe the slider on the top might be like the brush size and the fill color might also have a, a, a spot where you can go ahead and change color. And it would be amazing if they can go ahead and create, let's say, much more varieties of colors. So just in case you want to mix grass and dirt together, all of those things you can do when you're painting organically. I still understand that this product or this app is still in the development stage and a lot of things are still bound to change over time. I will be very excited if this is actually out and I would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section below. And if you like this video, simply give it a like and don't forget to share with your friends. And if you're new here, it will be awesome if you can just smash that subscribe button and also turn on notification so you will be the first to know once we release a new video. And until I see you guys again with a tutorial review, free Friday updates, tips and tricks and things like this, peace.